open unto them, understood not. Hey, they understood or not. You know? Right, but they understood or not, man. Why? Well, because sometimes, hey, it ain't meant for certain people to get it. That's just true. You understand that? It ain't meant for them to get it, man. You know? Yeah. Understood not, but despised it. But despised you know, no way to despise them on the street. Man. You know what I'm saying? What's no way to despise them? I they don't know what they're talking about. No way to despise them. They look at us like we just some regular niggas out here with, with, with dresses on, speaking the Bible. But at the end of the day, what the scripture say? Then they said, no, what? Prophet done the wrong thing. Because the things they heard and things that we speak, they going to see it. It's going to come to pass, man. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 5 starting at the top. Then shall the righteous man. Then shall the righteous man stand in great boldness before the face of such as have afflicted him and made no account of his labor. Hey, then a righteous man. Alright, because it was a time that we were not hurt. There was a time that the spirit of him was a prophecy. Alright? But then all of a sudden the spirit of the Lord entered to the earth. Alright? Put the spirit on great things to put smoke in the gospel. So then, didn't everybody say this guy they want to get? No. This is what Psalm 5 and 1. This shall the righteous man. Then shall the righteous man stand in great boldness. Yeah? In the face of such a people, in the full picture of the so called white man in the other nation. When you go back to uh, Psalm 83, they tell you about these things, man. They made a problem themselves or agree with themselves to try to keep us a free the nation. Why? For them to stay on top. But now, guess what? The righteous men was going to the elect. Alright? What are we doing? We're standing in great boldness, man. That's right. We out here, this is the so-called white man kingdom. And we in his kingdom telling him he going to go and slay. Right. Is that not bold? Right. That's just like Jake uh, uh, game banging. And he, he a crip, and he go to the blood neighborhood, and he in the blood neighborhood, talking about, nigga, all y'all finna die. That's, 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 that's being bold, man. You know what I'm saying? And here it is, us in the spirit, we in the, we in the so-called white man kingdom, let him know that he finna go into slavery. All right? We finna be on top. Man. The Lord right. dealing with us, man. That's right. right. You know? That's great boldness, man. Stand in great boldness before the face of such as have afflicted us. Right, and, such a place, and the face of such as have afflicted us, which is going to these so-called white men of the other nation, man. They afflicted us, man. They licked the wounds, man. All right? And they constantly doing that to this day. That's right. You know? Okay, come on. It's Isaiah 13, I'm going to start at 1. The bird of Babylon, which Isaiah, the son of Amos, did see, lifted you up a battle upon the high mountain. That was the battle. It's true. Alright, because that mountain represents what's dusty. Alright, so that's what we're doing. We're looking at the two folks among the ghosts, man. Go ahead. So, and so the both of them shake their hands. Yeah. That they may go to the gates of the noble. Yeah. They say, oh, well, that's the point, you know. They say, oh, um, it's out that horse, man. The scripture said Isaiah 51. You know what I was going to say? Uh, brother, congrats, yeah, too, man. Yeah, brother, congrats, too, man. Yeah, you know, because like the brother was saying, the mountain is the uh, government, man. Like, like the brother was saying, we in his kingdom, call time to die for of his kingdom, man. You, got, you, got, you, got, you know, go ahead. Come on. Isaiah 50, 81. Cry aloud, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet, and show my people their transgressions, and the house of Jacob their sins. Uh -huh. Yeah, you say lift up their voice like a trumpet, man. So we exalting the voice on, uh, so they can go to the gates of the nobles, man. We tell it Esau to his face, he's the devil that the Bible speak of, man. That he finna go into slavery, man. That we gonna be on, uh, that we gonna be on uh, in the kingdom. That uh, y'all gonna be in subjection underneath yeah, us, man. Ruling, man. That yeah. we gonna be ruling, man. Yeah. And that's us uh, shaking the head and boldness, man. You know. Tables gonna turn, man. Slow for show. Isaiah 36, verse 6. Isaiah 36, verse 6. Lo, thou trustest in the staff of this broken reed on Egypt, where, whereon if a man lean, it will go into his hand and pierce it. So this prayer of King of Egypt for all that trust.
trust in him. Right, see, and that's going right to today. All right, the same thing, man. The king of Pharaoh in Egypt. Hey, where we at now? We're in the modern day Egypt. All right, going to the elites, man. All right, and everybody that trusts in him, guess what? They're going to be destroyed by thermonuclear missiles. They're going to be destroyed anyhow. Where is it going to the family? All right, where is it going to the hospital? Where is it going to the fever camp? All right, the race war. Hey, you're going to be destroyed if you put your trust in Babylon, man. Either right. way you go, man. All right? Go ahead. Verse 7, it says, But if thou say it to me, we trust in the Lord our God. All right, if you say it to him, hey, we trust in the how about you going to man. I have faith in the Lord, man. All right, we put all our eggs in one basket, man. All right? And this is in the how about you going to Go ahead. Is it not he whose high place and whose altars Ezekiel has taken away and said to Judah and to Jerusalem, You shall worship before this altar. Now therefore give pledges. I pray thee to my master, the king of Assyria, and I will give thee two thousand horses, and if thou be able on thy part to set riders upon them. Right. How then wilt thou turn away the face of one of one captain of the least of my master's servants, and put thy trust on Egypt for chariots and for horsemen? Yeah. And Am I now come up and and am I now come up without the Lord against this land to destroy it? The Lord said unto me, Go up against this land and destroy it. This says, of the king and Sedna and Joab unto Rebsheka, speak, I pray thee unto thy servant in the Syrian language, for we understand it. And speak not to us in the Jews' language, in the ears of the people that are on the wall. But Rebsheka said, Has my master sent me to thy master and to thee to speak these words? Hath, hath he not sent me to the men that sit upon the wall, that they may eat their own dung and drink their own piss with you? Then Rebsheka stood and cried with a loud voice in the Jews' language and said, Hear ye the words of the great king, the king of Assyria? Thus said the king, Let not his death can deceive you, for he shall not be able to deliver you. Neither let the dead make you trust in the Lord, saying, The Lord will surely deliver us. This city shall not be delivered into the hand of the king of Assyria. Hearken not to the dead for thus says the king of Assyria, Make an agreement with me by a present, and come out to me, and eat ye every one of his wives, and every one of his victory, and drink ye every one of the waters of his own sister. Trust in your power, trust in me. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, if you put your trust in man, what's gonna happen? It's gonna fail. You gotta put your trust in your high by Shamal Shop, man. Which way? It's gonna prevail, man. You know? That's what this breaking down. Uh, Isaiah 36 and verse 17. Until I come and take you away to a land like your own land, a land of corn and wine, a land of bread and vineyards. Beware lest Ezekiel persuade you, saying, The Lord will deliver us. Hey, the Lord is going to deliver us, man. That's our faith and that's our hope, man. All right, that's what I'm saying. We're the hope and the elect. Because we hope that the Lord deliver us, man. Because his word is as long as we pray for the truth, man. Now, he said he's going to deliver us. He said he's going to gather us from the four winds of the earth, man. All right, and we believe that, man. We got faith in that, man. If we did, we will be out here right now prophesying, man. All right. You know? Okay. Have any of the gods of the nations delivered his land out of the hand of the king of Assyria? Where are the gods of Hamath and Arphad? Where are the gods of Serbian? And have they delivered Samaria out of my hand? Who are they among all the gods of these lands that have delivered their land out of my hand? But the Lord should deliver Jerusalem out of my hand? Verse 21, But they held their peace, and answered him not a word, for the king's commandments was, saying, Answer him not. Then came Elikim, the son of Elikia, that was over the household, and said to the scribe of the son of Asaph, the reporter to Ezekiel, 
with their clothes red and told him the words of Rip Sickle. Oh, go ahead. You got it out. So Psalms 146 and 3. Put not your trust in princes, nor in the son of man, for whom there is no help. Yeah, that's right. The prince is going to what this government, man. He's all evil. Yeah. All right, going to the Illuminati. All right. Put your trust in them, man. All right. He said, well, I... Uh, all right, again. Psalms 20, 146 and 3. Put not your trust in princes, nor in the son of man, in whom there is no help. All right, there's no help for them, man. Why? Because the help is coming from who? Yeah, by Shabbat man. All right, that's where our help comes from, man. You know, there ain't no help dealing with the other nation, man. Why? Because they, they mission to be what destroyed. You gotta think about it, what the Lord is saying proper is he created a wicked for the day of evil. Alright, because they got one mission. And they 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 doing their mission right now as we speak. So it ain't no hope for them once they complete they uh complete their mission. You know, that's just like when a nigga sell out. This hey, when Esau gave him an order to do, well hey, another example. When when a person uh, 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 switch, you know, a person be snitching or whatever, you know, that his job was, hey, to set up the other person. <laughs> so he set up that dude to get to the top dude, what happened? They killed him. Take him out. Because that was his only mission to do, was to set up the main man. And once that main man got set up, he kept him off. That's all we needed you for, man. And the same way how the Lord is treating Esau either right now. He set him up. All right, he the whoop the sleep the nation of Israel. All right, once we got our punch, look at what the Lord's going to do with Esau. Kill his ass, man. It's the same thing, man. Go ahead, I. Let's sit on that. Go ahead, brother. All right, I got Isaiah 30 and 9. That this is a rebellious people, lying children, children that will not hear the law of Yahweh, which say to the seers, see not, and to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things, but speak unto us smooth things. Yeah, and that's, what's, and that's, that's the thing uh, of these church people. That's why they don't really come down here. Like, like we read in uh, Isaiah 1, cry loud, but not. So we really, we really ain't sparing your feelings when we come out here with the truth. But when you go to the holy houses, the churches, the pastors ain't got nothing but smooth things for you. Right. Everything gonna be good. God is our love. And you know what I'm saying? God won't do no wrong. God, this, Jesus, that. But when you go to the scripture and read for yourself, the Lord is a man of war. He got that action. He got bloodshed. And what do you have a shot saying? He cut the blood. That's right. He got a sword ready to kill. But the, the, the scriptures say this, but here your pastor telling you this. It's smooth thing. Jake don't want to worry about what's going to go on. You don't hear no pastor, no preacher talking about Jacob Trump. Talking about Mars and all. Talking about the all uh, about the chill. How long have we been going to church? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Citrus. We never heard about the mark of the beast. And this, this is a New Testament. We're talking about Revelation. This is a New Testament. <laughs> but where have you ever heard about that? Never. Why? Because they only heard to, to speak the smooth thing to keep our people uh, uh, in a bind, man. Yeah. Confused, man. Yeah. But here it is. We out here speaking the truth, man. Yeah. That's, why only, that's why the truth only meant for certain people to get it. Yeah, that's right. The elect, man. Go ahead. You done, go ahead. You done on that? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. This is going to prove how, how the Lord's Son's coming back. Your, your so called Jesus. This is, this is what He's really going to come back and, and do, man. He's not coming back with sunshine and rainbows. This is uh, Isaiah 66 and 15, reading out of 16. Come. For behold, behold, the Lord will come with fire. And with His chariots like a whirlwind. Hey, what was that is? Isaiah 66. For behold, the Lord will come with fire. And with His chariots like a whirlwind. They ain't going to bring it out of church. Because that's when the prayer going to come. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because they believe in their pastor. They believe in the deacon. They believe in the bishop. So if pastor bring that out in church Sunday, the Lord come with fire, I going to be some prayer going on. going to get some act right on. Some act right starting to happen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because they know that the pastor said the Lord coming. And the Lord going to come with it. You know? Go ahead and hop. Surrender his anger. Hey, they don't teach that the Lord is bad. They teach that what? Jesus come for love, man. <laughs> yeah, he come for candy. Uh, 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 uh. Pots and, 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 and roses and flowers. Hey, that what you were taught? How Jesus coming? He's coming. Wait, what he coming with? Ha <laughs> ha, this I right. had. There, there you go. There you go. <laughs> I see y'all go to church. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, 
Like it. Hey, 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 to render his anger, the Lord is mad. Remember that the Lord is mad. To render his anger with fury, and to render his anger. Why the Lord angry, man? Angry with the wicked every day. Why the Lord is angry with our people, man? Yeah. We ain't talking about the heathens. We talking about our people. Two thirds of our people. Why is the Lord is angry with our people, man? Go ahead, I. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I, he he finished up. Why the Lord is mad? So. Oh, yeah, I know it is. Yeah, what? Psalm 7 The Most High judges the righteous, and the Most High is angry with the wicked every day. Ooh, he said he judges the righteous, but he is angry with the wicked every day. Yep. This Hosea 4 1, hear the word of the Lord, you children of Israel, for the Lord had a controversy with the inhabitants of the land, mm. because there is no truth, mm. nor mercy, nor knowledge of the Most High in the land. That's right. And how long? How long? Uh huh. You can find that. Uh, Get that out because we got to get here, bro. Because that's what's been going on since the apostles hit the street, man. You know what I'm saying? Because brothers have been going to church, man, all their lives, man, and been deceived, man. We got to get in there now. They say, Hear the word of the Lord, your house, Bashem, Shai, you children of Israel. For the Lord had a controversy with the inhabitants of the land because there's no truth. See, there's no truth because. When we went to church, they didn't tell us who we was. Mm -hmm. They didn't tell us who the Most High and the Son was. You know what I'm saying? They didn't let us know that we were Israel. They didn't let us know that we was in captivity. So they were telling the truth. They were feeding us lies and bullshit, man. Yeah. Go ahead, Doc. They say, uh, because there is no truth, no mercy. No mercy. Well, what is the mercy? This, this, this knowledge and wisdom understanding. Because that's how you gain mercy within this knowledge. Because what you do is about believing. What 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 uh Jerry Five Eleven says you shall rehearse the mercy of hey. And what you believe and start doing it and, and, and rehearsing contain what? Mercy. The Lord started dealing with you, started supping with you, man. So it was no mercy in the earth, man. But it was before. And then we did not bother that job. Go ahead, I was saying no knowledge. No knowledge. Knowledge of what? The truth. Knowledge of who we really are. Who the so-called white man in here? Who the so-called Chinese here? You know what I'm saying? It wasn't no truth in that. We didn't know. Right. Uh, we thought we were black. We were African American. They was white people. They were Chinese people. They were Japanese people. Not according to the scriptures. The scriptures say otherwise, man. That's right. No? And I, and I think it's no knowledge of the true power, man. Which is your how about Shemel That's right. That's it, man. They said, no knowledge of the most side in the land. Yep, no knowledge of the true power, man. And his what? His judgment. His because judgment. what the scriptures say, he is known by what? His, his judgment. judgment, man. The Lord Yahweh is known by his judgment, man. We didn't know that. We didn't know that. You've been baboozing. You've been baboozing. Mm -hmm. well, this is why the Lord's angry, you know. And, and, and for Esau to label this nation as one nation under God, that's, that's completely against... Anything that you're saying, how is how is one nation under God, and we don't know God's true plan for the earth. Yeah. God's true plan for the earth is to have us in power and to have all these other nations in subjection to us. Yeah. So no, nobody knows that yeah. until now. Yeah. It's saying by swearing and lying no. and killing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> It say by swearing and lying and killing. Hey, hey, that's what he did. Rape, rob, and murder. Yeah. Yep. It's, it's swearing and lying. Uh, but that's how you get in the church house. Yeah. And lie. Yeah. Lying. Yeah. Bullshit. Go ahead. And stealing and committing adultery, they break out in blood, touch your blood. Ooh, that's how you get. Yep. <laughs> you can't go wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? That's how you get in the church house, man. Shalom, Kalabi, buddy. Yeah, Pastor, man. Shabbat. This is how you get here in the Babylon and Grace. This is what America uplifts. Blood touches blood, stealing, adultery, fornication, idolatry, 
This yeah. is why the Lord is upset with this place. Yeah. Yeah. He said, uh, Amos 9-8, hey, boy, can go out there as well. You know, yeah. this is why this place got to get destroyed, man. Yeah. The Lord is upset with this place, man. Okay. The prophecy is speaking. Yeah. You know? yeah. The prophecy is speaking. We're in the end of this, man. You got it. Uh-uh. Go ahead. We got this is Habakkuk 2 and verse 4. Behold, his soul, which is lifted up, is not upright in him, but the just shall live by his faith. Yea, also because he transgresses by one, he is a proud man, neither keepeth at home, who enlarges his desire as hell and is as death. So how can this nation be one nation under God, but the scriptures talk about this man being as death? As death. God. This man is likened unto death, man. Meaning there's not you there's no life that comes from Esau, the so-called white man. You can't think about one good thing that this man has brought into the earth. Everything that he brings into the earth, it is it, it, it kills you or it, it it don't last. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get your brake stamp changed every so thousand <laughs> couple miles. You gotta get your oil changed every ten thousand miles. Cars don't last. Your body uh, yeah, it ties and everything. Yeah, you look at, Houses. Look at the street. Right. Potholes. Oh, it's shit. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Plastic. Plastic break down your uh, your mill system. Uh -huh. Technology, man. Radiation. Trees can't fucking breathe. Trees get it. That's the that's the biggest square a damn tree will get in Babylon. <laughs> it ain't even no grass in that bitch. You know? That's how we get our ice cream. You got these fucking animals that uh, locked up like uh, animals, man. Yeah. They are animals. I mean, they are like, prison. Cages, man. They are prison. They are prison. Everybody in prison, man. Yeah. What, what Jake be saying? Jake be like, well, I'm not racist. But these so-called white people, man, they be doing too much. <laughs> well, they, uh, they be saying, I hear that old man, white people, man. So, I want to do this one for you. Uh, Job 13 and 4. But ye are forgers of lies. Ye are all physicians of no value. Mm. Yeah. Forgers of lies. Got to remember, he's talking to father up. He's the father of lies, man. I'm like, ooh. Hey, hey. Mm. Speaking, Speaking of lies, good. man. Uh, even, even to the point that our people... Alright, hey, took on the customer there. They lied. They sold out, man. They took that bag, man. And here they pushing the agenda of Esau. Lying to the people instead of telling our people the truth, man. That's why our people are going to be destroyed too, also. You know? You got that. Okay, now. Got the Amos. Yeah, Amos, Amos 9 and 8. Behold, the eyes of the Lord power are upon the sinful kingdom. Now who are the eyes of the Lord? The angels. All right, because they the ones that report everything back. Tell you know how about shit on shot, man. All right, and also, we the eyes too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So really, the Lord, you have to watch it three times. Himself, the angel, and the men of the Lord. You know what I'm saying? So ain't no way around it. We should listen all three ways. Hey, yeah, because it's good to talk about uh, men signed the crime for the abomination that none of them Yeah, we tell them. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Righteous things. Yeah, we're yeah. Righteous yeah. right yeah. 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 I'm yeah. telling them. Videos every day. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. We, hey, that, that's a beautiful point, man. We tell the Lord every day by praying, you yeah. know, hey, Lord, how long will this endure? Yeah. Which is good to us say. Please come back and destroy East Hey, yeah. that's us hasty in the day, man. That's right. right. To get out of this place. You know, you wake up with one of them curses, man. Yeah. You this place to fuck in Oh. In this place, it is simple. You got a state, well, a city called Sin City, man. You know? Las Vegas. Las Vegas. Las Vegas. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, it's so much bullshit going on. But, yeah, this is this, 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 uh, the, uh, like you said, Sin City. This is a simple nation. This is a simple kingdom. Yeah, do it that will. Yeah. Just do it. Yo, play yo, you know? You know what I'm saying? Go play yo. You was, you was built and guided upon what? The law of statutes of men. We have our do's and don'ts. Esau, he don't have no do's and don'ts. But us being Israelites, we have do's and don'ts. That's why the Lord told us, man, uh, if he's not the oppressor, to choose none of his ways, man. Because the Lord gave us the guideline to go about, and it is the Bible, man. You know what I'm saying? The Bible is just for the wicked and the wicked. You know what I'm saying? They choose all their ways. That's why we get punished. We get punished up, man. You know, and that's why they gonna get punished the way they gonna get punished. Why? Because they choose to take on the custom of the heat. This is Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 2, verse 1. For the ungodly said, 
reasoning with themselves, but not are right. Our life is short and tedious. In the death of a man, there is no remedy. Yeah, it's good. Uh, what they say? We only got one life to live. Uh, also, okay, so in this life to live, right here, you choose just to be wicked. Yeah. Instead of living up, say, I'm going to try to make my, my great change. This one life time that I got to live, I'm going to try to live the best I can in the sight of the Lord to make it to heaven. Right. <laughs> but now, I'm going to do all the wicked shit that I can to live the best life as wicked and I can make it to hell. Come on, man. Your best life on earth, and here it is, you're going to go to hell forever. Yeah. That what you're choosing to do? That's why I love that to destroy these niggas, man. Because their mindset, the mindset that y'all have. Instead of having a mindset that I'm going to do everything in the good will of the Lord, everything the Bible says, do, I'm going to try to do that to make it to heaven. Yeah. I don't love to have mercy on that. Yeah. He chose to do according to the scriptures and see if he can make the kingdom of heaven. Come on, man. That's, <laughs> No, that's why I love him to destroy that nigga. Because he better to, to live wicked and then still go to hell to live right and try to make it to heaven. You know? They got that spirit. They'd be like, shit, what the hell is it? Yeah. I'm going to die anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you're going to die. But this time you'll come back in righteousness, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You're going to come back in Hebrew hugs. <laughs> you're going to die, though. Yeah. In, in the death of a man, there's no remedy. Neither was there any man who wanted to return from the grave. I'm just not a good Hey, six. see? You see that? Because they don't know according to the scripture. Because what, what Ecclesiastes 12 and 7 say, though? Uh -huh. The dust returned to the earth, and the spirit returned to the most high who gave it. Uh -huh. But and here it is. They think that shit, once they die, they just die. There ain't no more. Ain't no more coming back. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Well, hey, the church is teaching that, but when we come out on the highway to hell, oh, we got a whole other turn for you. We let you know, boy, you, you going to come back. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you back you, right now. Yeah, yeah, you don't know how you died your last past life. But get what? Your ass back? You know? Why do people say deep days are boom? You think they've seen it before. Yeah, right? uh, because you went through it already. You come back in your same lot anyway. So you're doing the same shit. That's why things be like, man, I think I've done this before. Yeah, that's true. That's true. The, um, the spirit of prophet is something to the prophet. Because we were the prophet in our last past life. That's what? You're a prophet in this past life. It's like a prophet in this past life. It's like a prophet in this past life. What's your main focus? Salvation. You know what I'm saying? Because you the ticket. You the ticket out of here. You know what I'm saying? But ain't nothing wrong with that. Enjoying the, the present thing that's in your face right now. You know what I'm saying? Enjoying the, the, the sky for you or you go uh, on a uh, vacation or whatever. Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. You know? But don't let that be your main focus and forget you about you. How about you know what's up, man? But forget the Lord. And let us speedily use the creatures like as a youth. See? Don't know. Let's say rule the world, but know what? Abuse the world, man. You know, everything, is, everything is set in order. How you have our how to set it in, man. You know? Go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, yeah. Let us fill ourselves with costly wine and ointments and let no flower of the spring pass by us. Let us crown ourselves with rosebuds before they be with it. Let none of us go without his part of our voluptuousness. Let us leave tokens of our joyfulness in every place. For this is our portion. So like, for this is our portion, <laughs> just like, is this. Right, look, just like the king, when you go to uh, 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 King Tuck, and all the kings of Egypt, put all they, you know what I'm saying? They, they try to die with everything, everything they had. <laughs> put it in the with it. Too. You know what I'm saying? Now Esau digging it up now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Bear me with it. That's the same spirit that Esau had. And Esau trying to push upon our people. Well, you know, Drake. I was just about to say that. Yeah, Drake and um, the big boss or something. Yeah, when I die for my money. Put my money in the grave. That's what Two Chain said. He said, when I die, bury me in the uh, Gucci stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, who's that? Okay, got one. Did you bring it out? But that's, that's, see? See, that's the mind state of the heathen. 
That's why the Lord said, if it is not your presence, choose on his ways, because you choose the ways of the heathen, you, it leads you to death. Because Esau is what? Death. death, man. Death. We can't believe in this nigga, man. You know, I trust and I believe in this guy about shot, man. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, Doc. Come on, I got Jeremiah 5 and 28. Oh, yeah. They are waxing fat. They shine. Yea, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. Ooh, and that's, that's talking about our people. That's talking about two things. Look at these niggas today. Tell them they overpass the, the deeds of the wicked. Okay. <laughs> Man, look, I had a bro yesterday. I said, this ain't got to be nothing but a day. Hey, we 26. This nigga already, uh, he already crippled in a bus thing. And he went, he got right down by me and slowed down. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I had to just shake my head and overlook it. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, the nigga, man, I'm talking about straight up. No, he had a demon on him. I, he was riding there first. I come through the park a lot. They know sure he come by me. I was just slow down. And you know how me, I was fast. So I come down the snow. And I had to sit there and wait till this nigga. Pass you. <laughs> I like, man, look. You know what I'm saying? That's Jake. Jake got a damn brother. Jake just being wicked. Jake got a stun on you. I'm talking yeah. about. But he crippled. <laughs> <laughs> he got a whole, he got a whole motherfucking walking thing in the back seat, and he, and he holding on the cane while he driving. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's just how shows sure you how how wicked our people is, man. You know what I'm saying? Deal with that. Uh, 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 I, they, I've been even toward their brother period. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Our people became more wicked than the wicked. That's what I say. It's so past what I... Can I get? Jeremiah 5 and 28. They are waxing fat. They shine. Yea, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. I right, because Esau, well, he, Esau homosexual. They, they, that's they, 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 they natural. That's they natural. You know what I'm saying? So, but Esau, he still got a suit on. He behind closed doors. You wouldn't even know he saw a fact. Jake Flamboyant. <laughs> he Flamboyant. He Flamboyant. Jake, everything Jake take from the so-called white man is wickedness. They take to the 10th power. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you heard things about in, in, uh, back in the 90s and the 80s, behind closed doors. Down low. That shit not no more. That shit out in the open. Our women's out in the open. Out in the open. You know what I'm saying? The animals out in the open. They even turned our animals to be, be uh, 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 homosexuals. You know what I'm saying? Our animals doing the shit. Gender neutral. You know what I'm saying? From this devil, man. You know? That's how you know that this place got to be destroyed, man. You know? Go ahead, Doc. Okay. I'm, I'm going to jump up two verse Jeremiah 5 and 26. Go ahead. For among my people are found wicked men. Yeah. Mm. Among his people are found wicked men. You know, sellouts, man. Oh, they lie wait as that set of snares, they set a trap, they catch men. Yeah. Verse 27, as a cage is full of birds, so are their houses full of deceit. Yeah. Therefore they are become great and waxing rich. Mm. Is that, is that, 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 that our people get paid in the church? That's why our people become so-called pastors and preachers. They become rich by what? Lying to the people. Who gave them that money? Esau. Uh, uh, TD Jake. Look what the nigga got. Uh, Crepe Dollar. Look what the nigga got. Hey, you remember the, uh, you remember what you were saying earlier, too? You don't ties? Yeah. Shoot you in the head with the Uzi. You don't ties, how you gonna spray your ass with a drink or some shit like that? He said that Jesus ain't coming back. That's what they would be doing to people who they ain't pay tithes. He'd be, be killing niggas that they ain't pay their tithes. Damn. 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 And that's it. That's on YouTube, bro. Like, it's his voice document. He ain't no editor or nothing. No. Who, who said that? Creflo. Creflo. Right, yeah. I played hey, it this morning. I'm going to show y'all. I can't show y'all. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, when have you ever known an AT, AT, ATM machine in a church? In a church. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Inside church. Inside. I, I, I ain't got my time today. I ain't got my time by the bank. All right, don't worry. ATL, right there when you come in. Like the strip club. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. ATL, inside the church. That's how you know it's all about the dollar-dollar bill, man. Yeah. 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 You know? That's why the Lord is getting away with it. Filthy Lucas' sake, man. Yeah. Man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 Ye
got one out. Yeah. Bring that out. Gun. This is Psalms 50 and 16. But unto the wicked, the most I said, what has thou to do to declare my statutes? Or that thou shouldest take my covenant in thy mouth, uh -huh. seeing thou hadest instructions and cast my words behind thee. When thou sawest a thief, then thou contested, contested with him and hast been partaken with adulterers. Thou givest thy mouth to evil and thy tongue framing deceit. And this talking about the so called white man. It's yeah. all you know, man. Yeah. You know, he's, hey, he's spread in on the Bible every four years. And that's it. You know, that's it. Every four years, that's when the Bible comes out. <laughs> you see? When he don't keep the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most High, or nothing like that, man. Uh, you know, that's why Daniel, uh, the seventh chapter, said he, he should think to change times, laws. So, they speak great words against the Most High, man. Yeah. He ain't praying the, uh, uh, the statues of the Most High, man. He let Decepticons walk. <laughs> you know, ABC uh, group walk. LGBTQ. You know? Man, hey, yeah. he, he allowed Esau to, to make up another group, Proud Boys. Proud Boys. Proud Boys, man. You know what I'm saying? I remember when uh, the KKK tried to come down to the river, and then all the Crips and shit, you know what I'm saying? They had gathered together all the Crips, you know, all different types of sets of Crips. And um, they were like, shit, they're going to be the KKK right down here on Tufts, right down here. You know, they about that the, uh, racist uh, man on the horse. <laughs> See, they shut that shit down. You know, they came to them personally. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The police, all the sheriffs, like up there, National Guard, all types of, you know what I'm saying? Policemen, man. Yeah. And, and, and invaded the, uh, the Crips section or whatever. And told them it wasn't gonna go down like that. Yeah. Here it is, Esau, he allowed Edomite to make a whole fucking group called the Fry Boys, and here they get to walk up with the damn bill. All around downtown. Yeah. Hey, and Trump told them the whole facts. Yeah. The whole facts. Stand, Stand by. Stand by. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's how he's the step of the so called white man, man. Yeah. You know? Man. He ain't he ain't living according to what the scripture is. That's why I say, why did I have to do it my statue? You know, the judge, the judgment of the Lord is not going to court in this earth right now. But it's the judgment slack. Yeah. You know? Yeah, it is. He saw the hold up a judge that he had by Shabbat Shai. He got his own laws, man. Yeah. He got laws to cover the other law, to cover the other law, to cover the other law. Yeah. So either way, he going to get off and you can't. Yeah. Okay, fuck, you do know the law. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You are not going to get off. Why? Because you are... The enemy man. to them. Yeah. We are the enemy of Esau and the other nation. And Esau and Edom is the, uh, the enemy to us. Thus said the scriptures. Yeah. Go ahead. So Isaiah 10 and 1. Woe well, unto them that the decree unrighteous decrees right. and that right grievous, grievousness which they have prescribed. Right. Go ahead. Keep going. To turn aside the needy from judgment. And to take away the right from the poor, right from the poor See, of my take people. take the right from the poor. We already, man, down. Here it is. He's taking us even more down. You know what I'm saying? Taking everything from us, man. Making us work for it even harder. Jake, Jake. Hey, it, it was a, uh, <coughs> Adam Malcolm did a video. Jake got 20, 25 years. For some heads. For yeah, some heads. some motherfucking yeah. hot clipping. Yeah. Crazy. Crazy. And a nigga can kill a nigga. They get seven. Seven. Eight girls. Yeah. Maybe ten. Amanda Geiger. Got what her name? That Jake. That police officer. She got what? Seven years or something. You know what I'm saying? We're here and there. The judge hugged her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's unrighteous decree, man. You know what I'm saying? That he ain't probably got that many years for that, man. Yeah. Also shows even more that this is uh, not our risk because you can't even win the battle. You that's can right. never ever win. You go to the court, Jake gotta go pay this, do that. You don't win the battle at all, man. So that's also show yeah, proof to you that this ain't meant to you. Small, this small, ain't meant for you to live it up in this kingdom, man. It's the so-called white man's kingdom. That's why he's living it up, getting, uh, 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 getting, uh, getting away with all these murders and mass killings and everything because this is his kingdom. Yeah, you support that? I support that. I'm a member of the NFAC. I'm actually the, uh, the city commander of the NFAC. The NFAC. The NFAC. They're not fucking around coalition. Not fucking around for yeah, yeah, we just lay it back around. Yeah, 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 you know, you know, yeah. I know. So I don't know if you brothers are aware. This morning we're in Newton, Tennessee at the Academy off of Germantown Parkway. The Proud Boys, Trump members, Blue Lives Matter, all them guys. This ain't the winning place though, Germantown Parkway? Yeah. Uh, you know what you saw it? True, 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 true. Okay, but my point is, they were rallying there. They setting up for election day. Yeah. 
to come to all of the black communities here in Memphis, Tennessee on the next one. So my, my job is not to come over and try to recruit nobody to the NFAC or nothing like that. Then yeah, go ahead and get that out first and foremost. Uh, what I am over here to do is to uh, get you get everybody that's all know aware of that this is what is taking the place here in this city. It's not only going on in Portland, Dallas, and all those other cities yeah, out west yeah, yeah. or whatnot. It has reached our home base. In Nashville the other night, they had a big a big protest and thing out there. And now it has reached Memphis. So what I'm going to do is to say to your families and everybody else that you know, love and support, tell them to arm themselves. You know what I'm saying? So what happened in Nashville? No, they had a big old rally. They had another big rally out there on the grand protest and stuff like that. And so we've been watching, you know, paying attention, trying to see if it's going to reach the Memphis. You know what I'm saying? If it's going to hit Tennessee. Because one thing is the South. And so a lot of brothers and sisters. Are still up under the old state mentality where they are not going to just rise. They do a lot of speaking and talking about Esau and the Edomites, but when it comes to me power, weak power, a lot of people haven't got to that point. Power only respects power. They power. You know what I'm saying? Every, every time we ever came with a peaceful speech, they have always said, German shepherds on us, spread it down, walk on us, and keep killing us. Power only. Oh, talk to you. Alright, so so who you who you, so who you put your trust in? You put your trust in your gun or uh, put your trust in this? I put my trust in the creator of the universe and everything in you. So why you why you rely on the source of uh, artillery? So it's not relying, it's making sure that I am ready for what what comes to me because they getting together in big in big numbers. They getting together in numbers. So you would you would only be you would only be naive and underestimating the enemy. You would only be being naive and underestimating the enemy if you do not prepare yourself. If another brother right now said, All right, I'll be right back. The first thing you're gonna think is, oh he finna go do that. Come on, he finna go do the same thing. But when Esau was doing this, what are we doing? Are we just sitting back and, oh, well, you know, we're going to give it to the most high. Wait, okay, at the same time, I'm be giving it to the most high. I can't give it all to the most high because he put me here for a reason, I'm for me to what? do my part. Oh, yeah. He gave me responsibility. Yeah, right, right, he right. gave me, he gave, if not, then what he created me for. Yeah, he yeah, gave right, me yeah. a part to play. Yeah. So I'm going to play my part as well as him, as well as he playing his part. Yeah, so I'm going to, exactly, <laughs> most definitely. But I, like I say, once again, I'm not here to, uh, recruit anybody or nothing like that. All I'm saying is, hey, man, it's for real. Yep. It's real deal. So if you're going to throw a Bible or a book and bullets, or you're going to meet force with force. Get this. Well, I got the rest of it. Yeah, I got the Yeah, Yeah, Now, this, 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 see, do what you got to understand. You know what I'm saying? Dylan. With so called white man, right? This is how we know, right? All right, that's a blessing. What's, what's a blessing? The sword, the gun, uh -huh. the military. That's a blessing. It's just like, it's just like if I had it, created a game, right? When you try to play me in my own game, you think you're going to win? Like me, I used to play three so, hey, body. Now like put two that, in the red. It's my now game. Put that, put that in the same perspective. If you trying to go against Esau Edom, and his own, this his game. The Lord created him for that. So you being NFAC, they're gonna lead you to death. Because the Lord didn't set you up here to do that. He said you saw him up to do that. He didn't set you up to do that. No trust is supposed to be in the Lord and not in the gun. That's why we're gonna get the second Corinthians. Huh? The second Corinthians 10 and verse 3 going down to 4. For though we walk in the flesh, we do not war after the flesh. Hey, mm. when we walk in the flesh, we don't war after the flesh. Meaning, even though things happen to us, it say it say uh uh uh, uh see it not. It say uh be ye angry but see it not. Because a lot of things gonna happen to us. We angry, we wanna you know what I'm saying? But the Lord says see it not. Also the scripture said wait upon me. And we rise up to the prey. Who's the prey? He saw either. You have to wait on the Lord. You know what I'm saying? Our job is not to hear and take on action, because guess what? You're gonna die. You gonna put your prison. You'll never get out. He can do all these things to you. Guess what? You ain't got no power. You powerless right now. That's right. 
Oh, you power. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, you powerless more. right now, man. One more I know, I'm just letting him know right now. You powerless right now. You feel me? You powerless. Go ahead, huh? Verse 4. For the weapons of, of our warfare are not carnal. The weapons of our warfare is not carnal. All right? The weapons. <laughs> Get what weapon we got? Right here. It's a big old gun. Cow, 16 and 11. Mm. Hey, it's crap. Look at that clip. Look at that clip. Like an elephant truck. Right there. That's what we got. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's what we got. You remember? That's the, that's the gun that we hold. A 16 to left. Hey, a, a, a million rounds. You know what I'm saying? A million rounds. But mighty through the most high to the pulling down of strongholds. All right, now one moment. Then. You can go back to the he got it. Go ahead, Doc. Psalms 44 and 6. For I will not trust in my bow. Hey, mm. the bow back then was a, what? Arrow, right? But put that in the mind, they perspective. It's the gun. My trust ain't for How many times a nigga that rolled out on a nigga and tried to shoot him in the jail? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, plenty. Plenty of time. So you can't put your trust in the 4 5. You can't put your trust in the RA 15. Your trust is in. The Lord, how about you know what I'm saying? Go ahead, Doc. Now that shall my sword save me. Hey, your gun ain't going to okay, fuck you, Brandon Ho, like, like Rambo. You going to Rambo, how many guns? He had, he had like two RAs or something like that, and he like the motherfucker shooting like this. You know what I'm saying? That ain't going to save you, man. Yep. Okay, fuck, how many rounds you got? How many nuts, uh, what they call them? <laughs> Monkey nuts. Monkey nuts you got? <laughs> your boat is not going to save you. Who going to save you? You have about a shimmer with shot, man. That's right. And just what? Go ahead, huh? Hebrews 4 and 12. Hebrews 4 and 12. Go ahead. And the word of the Most High is quick. Hey, the Lord's word is quick. Go ahead. And powerful and sharper than any two edged sword. All Ooh. right, hold on. One more time. Let the brother put his, the jacket on, get a little warm. Chilly out. Bring it back out. Hebrews 4 and 12. For the word of the Most High is quick and hey, powerful. The, the word is quick and powerful. You feel me? You got, what, 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 what we were taught in this world? What we were taught in this world when it comes down to word? Stick it to stones, man. Break, break my, my bones. Word word the word. <laughs> shit, not according to the scripture. Look what the scripture. Look, hear the scripture. That's how you know that shit was a lie. Go ahead. Hebrews 4 and 12. For the word of the Most High is quick and powerful. Right? Mm. And sharper than any two-edged sword. Sharper than any two-edged sword. Go ahead. Piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit. Mm. Mm. Huh. Hey, I, I can stab like you. Yeah, I can stab you right now. Hey, You're going to hear from that. Hey, but what we talking about right now, guess what? You're going to think about this tomorrow. Next week. I'll be still in your head. You know what I'm saying? I'll be still in your head. Like, damn, he, he said this. He made sense on this. You know what I'm saying? Why? Because you trusting in your boat. It's not going to save you. Trust and your power. Okay. Okay. Go ahead, go see. Uh, I see your angle and I see how you coming. The angle and the method that you use, you had a lot of good, you had a lot of valid points. A lot of but the same angle and the method you use the same angle and method that the slave master used on the slaves when he chewed, when he had us to obey. He read out of the book. He read out of the book. They kept, they, 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 they kept, they kept us in bondage. They kept us slaves, listening. Hold on, hold on. I ain't guys. interrupt. I ain't, I ain't interrupt. I ain't interrupt not one time. Now, a lot of people, a lot of people want to blame Esau for the situation that we are in. But the situation that we are in is a plague that was sent upon the Most High. Now. If you pay attention to the signs and everything that's going on, right. I could be wrong, my brother. But at some point in time, it all it, it, it says in the in that in that book that you read from as well. Uh, it says in there that when we when, when we come back into ruling, we should not inherit our land, but what? inherit the world as a whole. We should well, we, we're gonna inherit our land and the world. And so, 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 so basically, we should not just inherit our land, but the world as a whole. You know what I'm saying? So the whole and, thing, and the okay, so things have to take place in order for that to happen. And to me, and what I believe in, if, and when, what I'm paying attention to, bro, he's lifting those plagues of offers, bro. You got to pay attention to he, And these are being lifted right now. All this election and all this, at, at, at the end of all this madness, bro, we're going to be in position. But it takes 
this right here, there has never been a bloodless revolution. Not one point, not, not, ever. Not ever. And then, you know, another thing, you know, another thing, white people look at us crazy when we when we say, hey, man, we want a piece of this land. You know, we want a piece of land. We can get out of rice and this and this. They died. They died for this land. A lot of them came over here. They died. They sacrificed. They, they fought the British when they came for this land. You think they going to give it to us? No, we gonna have to fight. We gonna have to see some blood. You know, you know, but but not, but not without this man's word. And, and I feel like with everything. No, 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 up and down with Go each other, bro. Not say nothing, not do nothing to try to knock each other at all. Be real. I'm talking about be real, be real or die. It gotta come to a point. It gotta come to a point, man. Am I gonna be solid? Am I gonna be blessed? Am I gonna be 100? Am I gonna be stand up? Am I gonna be for what's right? Or I ain't gonna be for nothing? You know what I'm saying? You said that the white people was fighting the British for this land? You know, you know, they are the British. You know, but, but yeah, okay, uh, but they came yeah, yeah, yeah. They had a, they had the war with Britain. Britain came over here when they was still when they was the colonies right. and all of that. Yeah. They fought. Who originally inherited this land? Who originally inherited who the land? When, when, when they when them fucking crackers came over here the first time. Who was here first? Yeah, it was just empty? That, no, it wasn't empty. I'm mean, you want to get into that movement right there, bro. I'm I'm gonna bag up a little bit. You know when they I'm talk about the bro. dog, you know when they talk about the dog ages in, in Europe? Us. That was us. I know it wasn't no it was the middle of right. times, oh, yeah. it wasn't no sicknesses <laughs> and all that. My blacks act like we ruled all of Europe. All right, right now there's a palace still in Czechoslovakia right now with African hey, kings and queens out. heads on them. Not not like cut off head like they yeah, killed or nothing. Like but like yeah, like, like the monumental heads okay. on them. You know what I'm saying? Like, every like soccer, that. every soccer team that you see, that all the little soccer emblems, the little soccer clubs, bro, those are black tribes. Bro. Everything about us, they stole all of it. So yes, they were already Africans over there. What's the Africans though? Native Americans. Well, I, I, I ain't gonna speak on what I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Now, 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 on that end of it, I don't know. But what I came over here, bro, is that I ain't even mean to even get into this. Into hey, this deep, spirit, this deep of it. You know what it's I'm spirit. saying? I only came over here just to speak on and just to say, hey, bro, well, was it, look, y'all arm y'all selves. Y'all be worried of what Esau and the Edomites are up to. Don't just... Don't get caught lacking. You wouldn't get caught lacking if I said I was gonna come back with the with the K. You wouldn't get caught lacking then. So why would you get caught lacking and say, well, I'm just gonna give the Bible hey, then, uh, or I'm just hey, gonna do it, this and that? Hey, wasn't Grandmaster the one that was gonna chop on our head? Hey, correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't Grandmaster Jay seen like as security for Trump on his ballots? Yeah, yeah. Hey, that's so not court though, bro. Yeah, see, I don't court, care. I don't. I don't. I say I don't, that because. In that day, the scripture say, "Wait upon the Lord." Hey, then, hold on, then we're gonna look. See, I don't care what Trump is doing. I don't care what that man is doing. He put something just together to defend black people. Who you voting for? That's what people. That's what people getting out. That's what people getting wrong. I ain't talking about Trump. I'm talking about Grandma Tate. Grandma Tate put something together for black people. You don't give a fuck about us either. Why you say that? You hear me? You got money, man. People don't care about us, bro. Leave your ass up. No, hold on, 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 you hear me? We put together money getting these guys apartments in their own names. You know what I'm saying? You can't. That's why I say I don't speak on what I don't know. Because right, I ain't right. trying to be looked at as being uh, ignorant and uneducated at all. So I ain't trying to prove a point. I ain't too proud for that. I'm yeah. just going to rock. No, if I don't know it, I'm going to let you know. Like when you saying that. Well, no, nah, bro, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know about that. I got to keep it real. I watch this. Hold on, watch this. Good. Chapter 9, 3, and verse 8. Therefore, wait here for me. 
Decided to do what I'm doing now up until what's taking place. Pay attention to what's going on. Anytime somebody black then got killed, bro, man, we will protest for a week or two. Man, these folks been protesting, bro, oh, that shit, that's, 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 for a hundred and something years, bro. That's times judge. are changing. That's that's times that's are that's changing, that's bro. Judge. Just, we just read the Lord said, wait a We got to get liberated. So you don't think he come? You don't think he come? You don't think he's sending signs? And shit like that. You don't, you don't think he's out of sign. Yeah. We out of sign. Okay, okay. True enough. But I'm saying, we you don't think that he, you don't think that he's showing us that? Like, hey, y'all. We're telling you, it's, we it's recruit. We recruit. It's going to be a revolution. It's going to be a revolution. But I got a question. Not a bloodless one. It ain't never been no bloodless one. I got you. So I got a question. So earlier we talked about how this is Esau's blessing, the gun, right? So here it is. So-called white man literally can make bullets in the basement. But all y'all can do is purchase it. No, that's a lie, bro. Can you make a bullet? You, my dad, my dad, ex-military, we got pressing machines. And okay, that's, that's, that's okay, okay. We pressing bullets with primers okay, and Okay, so that's, yes, that's sir. one it's family. It's educated it's on, That's man. one family. And so you got to reach one and teach one. Do you if know, you hung around you for a week, you'll be pressing. Do you know And then you can read, then you can give that to the E, bro. They out, bro. They out, bro. You got to have the wheel. You got to have the wheel, bro. You got to be like Vegeta on Dragon Ball Z. Vegeta was always my favorite character. He got Right. 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 Psalm 44 and 6 For I will not trust in my bow Neither shall my sword save me <laughs> Bro, hey, he talking about he got a bullet press What the fuck that got to do with hey. it? That's just one family Man. Out of how many niggas in this goddamn country Versus how many Edomites in this country You not going to win that battle Then you got to battle that, it's like, like That's <laughs> double minded on the Lord's part So here it is, the Lord going to bless this man with the, with the, with with the, the sword hey. But then he going to allow you to overcome him with his Hey, he never agreed either. Right. Yeah, he, he never he, agreed he, that I said that you gonna wait on the Lord. Nah, he never. You know what I'm that's why I asked him. That's why I asked him what is the green like. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah he green, green like, like Esau. Like, and, and that's just why our people gotta die, man. Because two thirds of two thirds, we gotta let them fill up the slot man. because they don't have no faith. That's why we're only searching this out for the elect. That's right. So Talk apparently his, he's not of the elect. <laughs> apparently the spirit ain't on him. Talking about his so son going. Talking about his son going to be busting the teeth. Your son going to get clapped. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Like that other video. Hey, what does it say? What does it say? Slight, utterly old and young, man. You think the Lord gonna uh, uh, excuse that shit? <laughs> Hell no, nah, man. That's not, in your not head. Not yeah. That's in your yeah. your father's yeah. behavior. Yeah. So, so all all your children have to suffer why? Because you're fucking angry. Yeah. Yeah. And, and on top of that, he was saying, you know, about the son do this and the that. That kid didn't know what the fuck was going on. Yeah. Right? He just sitting there with a hat on his head. He, he, he heard he heard some things he never heard. Before. Yeah, yeah. he's just he's like, what's going on? Shaking his head. I'm like, nigga, he didn't move. Yeah. What are you Jake talking like, about? Jake, like, you make us a battle. Come on, I'm this and that. You know what I'm saying? But you still ain't like, no three. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Even though I'm making violent points, I'm showing you through the scriptures that breaking it down to you playing, nigga. If you trust in your own self and your gun, you're gonna be destroyed. Hey, you gotta trust in who? The Lord. Lord. He don't wanna trust in you how about Shamal Shot. That's why. That's two thirds, man. That's one of the niggas that ain't gonna have to feel the wrath for the Lord. Got to. Gotta learn the hard way. If nigga, he couldn't beat you in his own game. But that nigga did. What that mean, what? It wasn't meant for him. But hey, he got condemned. Hey, it's built you though. Yeah. Uh, I said, you got you doing your own lot, me and our lot. Yeah, Somebody okay. gotta play that lot. It's a zealot spirit, man. He's he ain't showing the no. side. Y'all the side. He's showing the side. Y'all the side, man. In, in, in the signs, it's in the scriptures. Yeah. There should be upwards. Hey, let's grab 2nd Andrews 15 chapter, man. Hey, yeah, I thought we were going to get it. We couldn't get it. I saw it. I just got it. No, I had it on deck. I showed it. I just got it. I had it on deck. I showed it. I just got it. 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 I showed it. Also, um, Cain and Abel. Yeah. The Lord said, anybody take vengeance on Cain, they'll be uh, sevenfold against them, man. Yeah. Let's eat Saul Edom coming back, man. Why you think when you kill an Edomite, you go to jail for life or something? Yeah. But he kill, your, kill our people, so-called blacks, Hispanics, Latinos, that American Indians, they get out, get away, it's God's free, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I told him he said that. We talk, I told him that, man. Shout out to my mouth. Yeah, man, so, hey, Jake finish, man. Yeah. Trust in yourself, yeah. trust in your weapons to finish. Y'all can now get here, then we're going to read down on two days, All right, this is, uh, this is Jeremiah 5 and 21. It says, hear, hear now this, O foolish people, and without understanding, which have eyes and see not, which have ears and hear not. <laughs> Not a damn thing. <laughs> <laughs> that boy need about focus. Yeah. Yeah. He right in front of us. He right in front of us. But he couldn't see the truth. And he couldn't understand and hear the truth, man. You know? He wasn't listening. That showed you that Jake won't listen. That's why the Lord gave you two ears and one mouth. You should be doing more listening than talking. Yeah. He wanted to be like, hold on, brother. Let me get my point. Get my point. Bro, we tell you some truth, man. Yeah. You're over here talking. You're, trying, the truth. you're defending. Oh. You're yeah. trying to defend your arson and, and your guns that you got in your closet. Nobody want to hear that, man. That's not gonna save you. Nah, what Jay say? If you ain't got an AR-15, we'll get you. We'll, get you. we'll go for you. What? Cash up, you what? You got go fund me. Cash up, cash up, you. Nigga, PayPal and these other fucking AR. Man, this is funny as hell. You ain't got an AR-15, we'll buy you one. Then he talking about. Then he talking about how he had. They got brothers that was homeless and then when they down. On bills. Man, we do that for each other. Man, he's supposed so, to. So, so what the, what's, what's the difference? Besides, we ain't getting no goddamn guns. We ain't looking stupid. Walking around tight ass t shirts and shit. Hey, when he was cut, though, I told him we got a real chopper. Man. Oh, yeah, yeah. man. 16 11. Yeah. A million rounds. Yeah. 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 yeah, it cost 16 11. Hey, we strapped. 16 11. Hey, it's a car. It's a car. Hey, 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 it's a it's the car here. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, but oh, no. that's the day of the day. They dead, dead. Hey, dead, though. That's, that's they, they, they do have it on 31st. <laughs> <laughs> they have the day of the day. Damn, Hey, they going to be destroyed, too, but that's Jake, though, man. Hey, <laughs> this shit's sad, man. Yeah, bro. Now, we're at the end of this, and Jake's still acting like little kids, man. Uh, yeah. This is sad, man. I'm in the car. Look, 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 look,
Yeah, that's why his car got all these things fighting for shit. That's how you know that that's how people too, man. It's a time. Hey, all the tribe too, man. They ain't here. They ain't they ain't even through, man. Though. According to you, how about Shamal Shah, man? They, they through, man. Yeah, I ain't want to believe it. They through, man. They gonna be so-called Negro, Latino, they bring ain't Hispanic, man. You know? You ain't coming through the spirit. Okay, how about Shamal Shah trying to come back to the true power? Finish, man. Go ahead, all right. So second Ezra, I'll shut the nine, verse three. Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people. Hey, and that's what we see. And he talking about some down a river on Germantown Parkway. Nigga, that's where Esau, right, that, that's their dwelling place. Germantown Parkway, man. That's where they at. They at home right now. And, and that's a sound right there. <laughs> yeah. Then it said uproars of the people. Yeah. But like I had, I had just mentioned that before he came up about the crypt. And, yeah. and the KKK. Come, yeah. And then her, he come he, up he with it. You know what I'm saying? I just made that example. Come on, come on. You heard it. You know what I'm saying? Now let them bring that shit right back down here again and watch the Crips and everybody else come together one more time on their ass. They're going to do the same thing they did the first time, man. Yeah. Try to put an end to it. I don't think what stopped the Crips and stuff from, from doing that thing inside the police, it's all right. You know, they get the light right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's all right. They were here talking about pouring down storm rain. Yeah, I was trying to say, uh, yeah, uh, it's a lot of jakes, man, going to get put to death, man, trying to have that mentality that they, that they can uh, go against Esau, man, with his blessing, man. You know what I'm saying? How the hell are you going to try to uh, uh, outgun a white man, a so-called white man, you know what I'm saying? You from the goddamn AR-15, by Draco. That shit ain't going to save you, man. You know what I'm saying? Jake ain't got no faith, man. He want to trust in, in, in a weapon that a uh, so-called white man made, man. Esau gave you Esau gave you this shit, man. He ain't fucked up about this. Uh, you think that's the end all be all, the, the Draco. Oh, hey, man. You need to strap up with the Draco, man. Get the AR before it's too late. Hey, yeah. hey, hey, when he said you want to get caught lacking, hey, man, hey, Esau got drones, man. Hey, right. Energy weapons. Yeah. Hey, what do you say on Friday? He ain't fighting fair. Yeah, he <laughs> Esau ain't fighting fair. He ain't fighting fair. Hey, they showed you that on the movie The Purge, man. Yeah, the Purge. Man, them, they came out, man. They killed a few people, man. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, when that drone came out, you seen the whole team get sprayed. Nigga, under, hiding under the car. Hey. <laughs> Everybody laid out, man. Hey. The drones ain't playing. They got a precept. Fuck it. I'm going to ask him too, man. So what's the end result for that shit? Y'all get into this whole revolutionary war type shit. Y'all gun down Esau. What's next? Hey, and that's a sign. Hey, let's grab it, Bobby. Let's go and grab it. This is 2nd Ezra 15 to 15. Read down to uh, 14. <laughs> Second Ezra 15 and 14. Woe to the world and to them that dwell therein. Yeah. For the sword and the destruction draw of nine, and one people shall stand up and fight against another, and swords in their hand. And that's the sign. Right. What are you talking about? Did the Lord give us signs? Yeah, and that's the spiritual man. And that's the spiritual man. That's 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 what I said. We broke out 2 Corinthians. Yeah. That shit corner right there. Yeah, back in 2 Corinthians 10 and 4, man. I believe in the Lord. We ain't showing no faith. AR-15 this, AR-15 that. Where's the faith, man? Yeah, sedition among men and evading one another. What's the sedition among men is? Why is civil authority, man? You know? Go ahead. They shall not regard their kings nor princes, and the course of their actions shall stand in their power. Uh -huh. A man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. Hey, martial law. Yeah. Checkpoints. Military checkpoints, man. Hey, yeah. hey, my girl sent me that today. It's going on right now in uh, Nigeria. 
Yeah, yeah, and sauce. Yeah, this yeah. shit going yeah. on, man. Going on so right we now, seen, man. we seen the signs, man. This let us know we're the end of this. That's right. So why the hell we gotta go get guns, man, and go join, go join that shit, man? No. <laughs> It's the first time. It's going to be a bloody revolution. Hey, get that in proper and say, uh, a cool man from see the evil and hide himself, man. We going to hide ourselves. We ain't ten toes down with that shit, man. We don't want no part of that, man. That's right. That ain't our job. Put this out in the open. Yeah, it's our last man see the evil and hide it himself, man. It said follow not the mother tools that do evil, man. Hey, what's our job, huh? Our job is come out here and prophesy, man. Yeah, this, this only the Lord people. gave us, you told us to yep. prophesy the downfall of that place, man. That's in the kingdom. And vanish not yourself. I told I told nigga, you powerless right now, nigga. <laughs> so my white man throw you in jail right now, how you gonna get out? You can't get out unless he what, let you out, man. You hey, powerless, bro. If I may add, you can't even get a gun without going through the uh through the uh, the system, the gun exactly. system. You can't even get the shit. You can't even get the permit, <laughs> you can't even get the permit man. Right. Shit. Right back. Man, shit. Hey, uh, you got to make sure you ain't hear me. Denied. Yeah. So, yeah. You don't got papers on your gun. So, they take it. They arrest so they, you. They want you to walk in there with a big ass. Or a small ass t-shirt with NFAC on it, and they expect the ECR to give you a gun. I know why you coming here. Man, show ass back. You got no permit. The clapping you got done that I just gave. Hey, we gonna read down on it. Go ahead, y'all. All right, this is Matthew 16 and 4. It says, "A wicked and adulterous generation seeking after a son." Hey, that's what he was saying. Why not? A wicked, what is that? A wicked and adulterous generation. Seeking after a sign. Right, mm. but don't even see the sign right in their face, man. Yep. All right, when have you ever seen a group of Israelites on the corner, man, prophesying to die following the brother, man? No. Until now. So no. We the sign, man, that the Lord is coming. Right. The Lord is on his way. That's right. The salvation we have to believe. That's right. We the sign, man. That's right. How long y'all been going to church, man? Right. Pastor ain't never told y'all this, man. Since salvation we than y'all believe, man. Never. We the sign, man. That's right. Right. Don't trust in no prayer. You trust in your house by your mouth shot, man. That's right. Go ahead, all It says, and there shall no sign. Go ahead, all And there shall no sign be given unto it but the sign of the prophet Jonah. Ooh. See? But the sign of the prophets, man. Jonah. When you come in that same lot. <laughs> what the Lord told Ezekiel? Warn the people. Yeah. Ezra, warn the people. Jeremiah. Right. Warn the people. Isaiah, warn the people. What's our lot? Come out here to what? Warn, warn the, the people. people. Right. On a dreadful day of the Lord, man, because yeah. it's coming. Right. There ain't no such thing we finna say, all right, we're gonna hold back, and hey, all of us, we finna be strapped out here. Right. We thought might come down down the hood since we teach them. Hell no. Yeah. We like, we making our body living sacrifice, man. That's right. That's right. That's right. We do come down here with a strap. Hey, we had Jake come down here with a, uh, with a strap. Yep. Hey, he ain't do shit with it because it was the Spirit of the Lord. Get yeah, Isaiah, he ain't do nothing but pull the motherfucker yeah. out. Isaiah 59, 59, 19. Hey, we don't trust in that, man. We trust in you how about Shemar Shot. That's right. Like, remember I told him, I said, how many times you done had a nigga pull a gun out and try to shoot a nigga in that motherfucker jam? Yep. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Time, 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 I did. You know what I'm saying? So you run down on east side with the AR 15. Click, 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 click. Now you're dead. Dude, it's the Lord doing it. No, it's yeah, exactly. It's the Lord but he put, he, he, put in trust, he put in trust in the gun, their boat, hey. instead of putting the trust in the house by Shabbat Shabbat. Hey, and if I may add, man. Esau got, man, bulletproof vest, Teflon vest with bullets just bounce off, man. Shit, wipe your ass out, Jake. Ain't the whole suit. <laughs> the whole suit. The mo they got movies. Yeah. With Jake got a whole hand to the toe yeah. suit on. Called the juggernaut, man. Bulletproof. <laughs> uh, John Wick, uh, uh, third one. You know? like, see, Jake watching the movie, Jake watching movies for action, but not seeing it through the spirit. Man. Man, he's already really got this shit, man. man he you living. Know I say he in the plain sight. He in the plain sight, man. He's all really got it. When he showing you, he really got it, man. Damn. But it's only only the elect can look at a movie and, and take the meat from the bones, man. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Only the elect can break down a movie like that, man. Me and the Lord, man, can break a movie down like damn. All right. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? He did that. Hey, I think he got that for real. Yeah, good. You know? But it takes the spirit to, to this is the society. Yeah. This is Isaiah. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. So like, this is Isaiah. Uh, 
59 and verse 18, 19. So like it. So shall they fear the name of the Lord Yahweh by Shem Shah from the west and his glory from the rising of the sun. When the enemy shall come in like a flood, the spirit of the Lord shall lift up a standard against him. That's, that's our weapon. Yahweh by Shem Shah is our weapon. It says, right. uh, the name of the Lord is a strong tower and the righteous run into it in a safe. Uh, safe. Not no gun, man. It said, it's, uh, the Lord will lift up a standard against him, man. Gun. Spiritual powers, man. Yep. You see? You don't have hey, to get a gun, yeah, man. Because when you go back to uh, Jeremiah, it's we find how the Lord going to bring a nation to fall off. Yep. You know what I'm saying? That we don't even know their language. Yep. Hey, look at Samson. You know? Man. He said the spirit of the Lord entered into him. What a job, bro. A thousand man. of people, man. Yep. That's a thousand of people, man. Spiritual power, man. And then I had brother try to get this piece up for Psalms 144. This piece about teaching my hands to war to fight. Yeah, King David. Yeah, yeah. Exactly, bro. So yeah. we ain't got to trust in, 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 in the modern day uh, gun, or the modern day uh, bow, which is the gun, the military. We ain't trusting that shit. Why? Because the Lord going to put the spirit on us, man. And that's why I wanted you to get that, that, that piece up in uh, Ezekiel, because he talking about some. Uh, uh, the bloody uh, Luke Revolution War. We're going to show you what the Lord is going to uh, give us, man. Because he said he's going to do it to him according to his family. So everything the Lord going to put in us, man, we're going to have the spirit of the Lord on us. Hey, our forefathers flew the lions with their bare hands, man. It was the spirit of the Lord on them, The King man. David fought a lion you know? for the sheep. Good. You know what I'm saying? Like the Lord had the spirit on him, man. How much more us in this time? The Lord going to put the spirit on us to take her business. When time need to be done, man. Yes, Fuck a gun, man. Yeah. Even hey. as a protection. But we don't put our trust in it. Yeah. Uh, as you say, uh, him, him that live uh, by the sword should die with the sword, right? That's why Esau blessed him with what? The sword. The sword. Yeah. Hey, it's add up. So Think about it. The Lord blessed Esau with the sword, right? And what he said, he that live by the sword should what? Die. Yeah. So Esau gave him, I mean, it's like it. The Howard shot with his eyes gave him a weapon. A death. That was his blessing, yeah. Because you live by it, you're going to die by it. That was your blessing. So guess what? You're going to die by your blessing. You know? Yeah. Hey, simple play. Uh, what scripture to uh, uh, stand in and be looking up? There you go. He said he broke it up. Okay. Yeah. It's beautiful, man, that we able to break down these scriptures, man. You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's all in front of your neck, man. Because we understand that he didn't have the ears to hear even though we're breaking it down to him and showing it to him in the scriptures, he can understand it. But he had his own agenda anyway to push forth what he what he believed, and that's the NFAC for us. Revelation 22. You know? I got it for you, sir. There's a lot of J's like that, though. They just come up here just to talk instead of listen. You know? In his mind, he's woke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These yeah, guys yeah, come yeah. up here and talk, man. They, 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 they uh, perceive themselves in that they're woke. Yeah, you still call yourself hey, fucking right. black. How the hell you fucking woke if you think you still black, nigga? That's a color. Uh, <laughs> nigga, to have, even to have, try to fight for equal rights. You, you dumb. Dumb. You, you're a sighted child. Man. You're stupid. You think that you're going to actually fight for some rights, man. If you think of that, being with the NFAC and going against Esau, you're going to bring some justice. No, sir. <laughs> you remember not too long ago that they just had some members that shoot themselves in the damn foot. They said, yeah. Yeah. Like in the leg. So you you don't even know what you're doing with the AI. You, you just you just getting weapons, man, just to have them. You don't know how to hold it. They don't know what, how to shoot, you know what I'm saying? Shoot, like, shoot, like, yeah, you gonna fuck around and, 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 and what they call friendly fire, you gonna hit your own man. Yeah. You know? Yeah. They're trying to yeah. knock the motherfucker back. Yeah. Right. So just having a damn gun ain't good enough, man. You gotta know what you're doing with it. That's what I'm trying to say, man. So what, what good is it to have that weapon and you don't know what to do with it? You see what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why we putting our trust in your house by shooting our shot, man. You know, yeah. hey, 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 the weapons are all warfare are not coming. Yep. Right. But, right. hey, fuck around with a gun, anything can happen with a gun. Man, yeah, anything yep. can happen. I learned that. Hey, I know that from experience, bro. Me, myself, fucking around with a gun. Anything can happen to a gun, man. And you just holding a motherfucker in your hand. Hey, you get a uh, three-year-old, man, just yeah. killed his dad. Shot his dad in the head. Yep. I seen it on, uh, on the news, man. Yep. Uh, a three-year-old. Uh, I know that. Yeah. Really? For real. Damn. He blamed on his. He blamed on the. He blamed on the. Damn. Yeah, 
Yeah. 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 He popped him in the face. Yeah. My nigga lived though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but he got locked up. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Coming right back around, four, five, six, seven years later. Judgment. He get out. Judgment. Uh, now he killed from the back. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Personal. Personal. Yeah. Yeah. On the block. In front of my house. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. In, the, in the hood. Damn. Personal. Ooh. I said, ooh, that judge. That's yeah. all I can think of. Judgment. Yeah. All right, this is uh the book of Sirach, 2 and 14. Woe unto you that have lost patience, and what will ye do when the Lord shall visit you? Yeah, that's it. Woe unto you that have lost patience, man. You try to bend yourself and it's too, uh, uh, not wait till the Lord. You uh, lost and losing that patience, man. Uh. You want to do it on your own, man. You said woe means death, man. Uh. They have lost patience. Man, hey, you see, he lost patience. He lost it, man. <laughs> he only want to say, he ain't want to agree to, is he going to wait on the Lord? <laughs> he don't want to do that, man. That's even, that even goes to brothers who are in the truth and they fall out too because they lost patience. So, like, when the Lord coming back, the Lord take it too long. I'm going to go back to the world. That's what he said. Yeah. That's what he was saying. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, hey, that's what he was saying. He's like, so, how long are you going? You know what I'm saying? So, so, so you just want him to come in and walk? Walk right through our houses. Hey, <laughs> scripture says the Lord told us he would do these things, man. Yeah. But the Lord said he going to take his man through that, man. Yeah. Yeah. No yeah. evil should touch thee, man. Right, right. Yeah, I believe in that. That's it on that? Yeah, that's it. Right. Romans 8 and 24. No, Romans oh, 8, oh, and 8, 4. 8 and 4. 8 and 4. Salah. Romans 8 and 4. That the righteous of the law might be fulfilled in us who walk not after the flesh but after the spirit. Oh, you walk in the spirit, man. You know? Verse 5, for they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh, but they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. For the carnality, for to be carnally minded is death. Right, carnality mm. leads to death. Pleasing your flesh leads to death. Walking in your flesh leads to death. This is the shadow of valley of death, man. Yep, yep. You see? Yeah, yep. You know? But to be spiritually minded is life Woo. and peace. So to be spiritually minded is life and peace, man. And that's why we're chasing uh, spiritual righteousness, man. Yeah. That's why we want to walk in the spirit, man. You see? Yeah, it's a, it's a life and peace. Life. Life. You life from your trust in your weapon. Life. Life. You your life This is verse 7. Because the carnal mind is enmity against the Most High, for it is not subject to be the law of the Most High, neither indeed can be. Well, it's not subject to the law of the Most High, man. Hey, you can do whatever you want. This is what America pushes, man. Yep. You can do whatever thing you want. You can buy the biggest Draco. You can kill any nigga you want on site, man, basically, man. Well, hey, you got to pay the punishment for that, though. You know, you go kill uh, any man, you're going to pay the punishment for that, man. Right. The Lord going to destroy you, man, because you're not waiting on him, man. Right. Go ahead. Uh, so verse 8. So then they are, so then that they are in the flesh cannot please y'all. You're not going to please the most high, man. You zealots, man. You, not, you can't please the most high being carnal, man. Yep, right. And you're going to die. You're going to die here in America, man, in the upcoming uh, wars. Hey, they should stand uh, swords in their hand. You're going to die here, man. Verse 9, but ye are not in the flesh, but in the spirit. Right, we in the spirit, man. Because these are signs, man. We're talking about what we stand on. We stand on Yahweh Shema Shah. Yeah. Right. If so, be that the spirit of the Most High dwell in you. Right. Now, if any man have not the spirit of Yahweh Yahweh Shah, he is none of his. He is none of his. Because the Most High, Yahweh Shema Shah, that ain't dealing with the carnality, man. That's right. We ain't dealing with that bullshit, man. They put watch. Do on your own. All this shit the Lord ain't dealing with, man. He wants you to be spirit. I mean, he wants you to be uh, uh, in peace, man, with all men. He wants you to be blameless, man. That's why he said, avenge not yourself, man. Just wait. See, Jake don't like waiting. But it's good to say the Lord is long suffering, man. And waiting going to suffer. They're going to patience, man. 
It goes to discipline, man. Jake don't have no fucking discipline out here, man. That's why they're going to get destroyed, man. Rightfully so. That's right. We're telling Jake to wait. You don't have to go get a gun. Right. Uh, verse 10. And if your house shall be in you, the body is dead because of sin. Exactly, man. That's why we walk in the spirit, man. You got it right there? Yeah, yeah. This, uh, this is uh, Proverbs 14 and verse 12. It says, There is a way which seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. Mm. Right, man. He thinks, he thinks Jordan, the NLBC, is right in his eyes, man. Yep. You know? Yeah, man, that's that carnal mindset you, what you were just talking about, bro. That's that's going to uh, uh, lead to his death, man. Thinking that, oh, well, if I, if I get an AR, if I get a, 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 a Draco or whatever, you know, I can I can I can uh, have something to fight back with, man. Yeah. Not having no faith, not having no uh, 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 will to to nah. be patient and wait. Oh yeah, how about Shamal Shah? Right? They're gonna do what they want. And the state, the so-called white man, they already know about the about these uh, about these guys, man. They know about your your NCAF and all that stuff. They gonna be targeted to come at you, man. They gonna set your ass up. You thinking that you got all these guns on the table and in your closet? They gonna swoop in on your ass like a thief in the night and they kill your ass, man. You are fucking right. They think they're ready because they are. That doesn't mean you're good. Trusting in that sword. Don't put that stuff in. You need to have your possession. Yeah, please. This is 1 John 2, verse 16. For all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life, and the shadow of the father, but is of the world. The world passes away in the lust thereof, but he that doeth the will of the Most High abideth forever. Right, he that doeth the will of the Most High abideth forever, man. Mm -hmm. That's plain and simple, man. The Lord don't want you going out here avenging yourself, man. He said, vengeance is his, he will repay. You see? But you gotta teach the word, man, and have faith. You see? Patience, man. They ain't got no patience, man. They in that spirit of, uh, 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 that I want my money and I want it now. You know that shit. I, I want it now. I deserve it. You know, read the text hey, from. Gotta be, yeah, yeah. You ready to? Uh, <laughs> you know you ain't patient, man. Yeah. Hey, get that account uh, of uh, Maccabees. Uh, um, when they went out to fight without um, uh, I think that first Maccabees. Seven. Okay. I can bring out this. Go ahead. I got um, Revelation 22 and 11. Yeah. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. Uh -huh. mm. And he which is filthy, let him be filthy still. Hey, we gonna let those niggas be filthy still, man. Mm -hmm. If you ain't right with the Lord, we go. Hey, so be it, man. You know. Go ahead. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. Mm -hmm. Verse 12. And behold, I come quickly, and my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be. Mm. Yeah, that's plain and simple, man. man. You want us to be calm, we're going to let you be calm still, man. You know? Well, you still say the mark of the beast is just sin. We're going to let you be, man. They say, can't two walk together unless they be agreed. That's right, huh? You know? So we're going to let you be, man. We don't have time for this, man. We're at the end of this, man. Right. He's out here for come and have a great wrath, man. This is the book, yeah. back in the book of Sirach, 41 and 8. It says, Woe be unto you ungodly men, which have forsaken the law of the Most High, Yehowah B'ashim Shah. For if, for if you increase, it shall be to your destruction. Yeah. Hey, that's, that's going on now, though. Uh, we're dealing with our people and Esau. Because mm. our people are increasing. You know what I'm saying? Wickedness. You know what I'm saying? That thing will show to the wicked. Yeah. But what is fun though? Yeah. They're destruction. But they're destruction. Because at the end of the day, you have to see your what? Your constellation. Yeah. You know? And so it. It's going on right now. Mm. Look at us. Hey, hey, we increasing in the spirit. Yeah. But it's by our what? Blessing. By blessing, yeah. And flip that on the other side, they increase it in wickedness for their discretion. Hey, it's too bold, man. You know? I got a quick one. 
This is uh, 2 Ezra 15 and 4. It says, For all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. Woo! Straight he gonna die. to the point. Yeah, yeah, he's gonna, he gonna <laughs> die, man. He said he was ready to die for it know. anyway. It, yeah. Hey, <laughs> hey if, them, if them niggas don't come out of their spirit, man, and come back to their power, they're gonna die, man. It's for their destruction. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if they don't come out of their mind state of NFAC, man, they're gonna die, man. Yep. Straight up. They don't come out of their spirit, man. Yep. Because right. they say all unfaithfulness should die and they unfaithfulness. Why? Because they don't have they don't have faith in how about you shot. They have faith in their gun. They have faith in, in, in what's the nigga name? Grand, Grand, Grand Master Jay. Grand Master Jay. Grand Master Jay. Yeah, they got faith in him. Hey, you know what I'm saying? He's been proven to be a, a, a goddamn yeah, agent. You know what your brother said? Your brother hey. said that, and then he going to say something. It don't matter. Like, Oh, he did that. motherfucker ran for president. He was like, no. Oh, he, he said something He did all that. Ran for president, yeah. security guard. Oh, this shit. Motherfucker, he did that. He said something about Trump. I said, that nigga don't give a fuck about us. And he was like, Grand, I said, Grandma, they don't give a fuck about us either. He said, what do you think he don't give a fuck about us? That nigga paid. But if he did give a fuck about us, then what he'll be doing, he'll be spreading the gospel. Yep. Right. Because this right here leading our people to what? Salvation. Salvation. Doing the shit they doing, leading our people to death. Mm -hmm. This is gonna die fucking with him. That's right. But oh, you man. put your trust in your how about Shamal shot and come here. That's right. All right, this real church. What? Hey, salvation. You got a chance, you gotta, you gotta, you got a ticket, all right, to salvation, man. That's right, bro. You know, you got a chance to be delivered. You got a chance to be saved if you come and do this right here. But you going to do that? Oh, you're going to die. Ain't no chance. Sure. You're going to die. That's for sure right on. Because the Lord is not going to have a hedge around you dealing with that bull, man. Right. The Lord ain't dealing with that over there. The Lord dealing with this over here, man. That's right. The Lord ain't dealing with that over there. So you, you got to wake your balance out yourself, man. You know, but this is the little brother. Oh, I'm gonna go with these brothers. That's right. Where you at? Choose you this day. Life, life for death. death. Yeah. <laughs> we got life over here, man. That's right. right. That's how we speaking. We speaking life, man. That's right. That's the that's the spirit. They said the spirit what? Quicken it. You go to the word quicken it means what? To make alive, man. We telling you these words to make you alive, man. Because you know. All right. You gotta start to understand the spirit, the knowledge, and wisdom. Understand. You're not dead anymore, man. This is the violent a shadow of death, man. America. Our people walking zombies around here, man. They dead to the knowledge. They dead to the wisdom. And they also dead to the spirit. Man. They don't know. They go to church every Sunday. Still dead. Go ahead, up. Proverbs 21 and 16. The man that wandered out of the way of understanding Ooh. shall remain in the congregation of the dead. Hey, and they go to church every Sunday. Hey. Read that one more time, huh? Proverbs 21 and 16. The man that wandered out of the way of understanding. Right, this is the way of understanding. That's right. right. This, what is good? Somebody get Proverbs 1 and 20. Huh? No, 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 you got it. No, what did it say one more time out? The man that wandered out of the way of understanding. Wandering out of the way of understanding. He trying to get away from the truth. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He trying to get away from the truth, man. You wandering from the, from the understanding of your high by Shemal Shah. What are they going to do out? Shall remain in the congregation of the dead. Woo! Bring a life over here, man. Read it out. This is Proverbs 1, verse 20. Yeah. Wisdom cried without. She uttered her voice in the streets. What is the wisdom? The knowledge and wisdom understand is the spirit. Where do you get that from? The practice of the Lord. Right. You ain't getting that at church, man. In the hall of houses. You ain't receiving that. The wisdom and the knowledge is what? Put both her voice. She uttered her voice out in the streets in the cheap place of country, man. Which where we at right now? What she do, up? He said she cried from the chief place of concourse in the openings of the gates. Go ahead. In the city, she uttered her words, saying, "How long, ye simple ones, will ye love simplicity?" Mm. Go ahead, I know you can speak, up. 
Uh, it says, and the scorners delight in their scorning, and fools hate knowledge. Oh. Hey, that was a fool, man, because he didn't want to get this knowledge and wisdom and understanding of these scriptures, man. That's, this is really the only uh, true knowledge in the world, man. It, it, it's the knowledge of Yahweh about Shemal Shai, and it's truth we have, man. That bullshit that uh, he pushing with that NFAC, man, <laughs> hey, like, like Proverbs 14 and 12, man, it's going to lead to death, man. Yeah. Oh, hey. This is <laughs> Luke 17 and 33. Who shall ever shall seek to save his life shall lose it. And whosoever shall lose his life shall perish it. Yeah. Hey, that's plain, man. He's seeking to uh, uh, save his life, man. He's going to lose it. You know? You ain't going to, hey, hey, because ultimately it's all up to your house by Shema Shai anyway, man. That's right. He's the one that's in control, man. He's controlling everything. Yeah. Who to say you're going to be able to, be able to get to that gun, man? Yeah, he <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You might die of starvation. <laughs> you know? You might get eaten alive. Yeah. Fucking drown. Anything, man. The Lord got a million, million ways to take you out, man. Yeah. You thinking that's the only way you can go out, man? Uh, if I have my gun, you know, uh, I'm going to spray my way out of there, man. <laughs> you know? <laughs> and then on top of that, you know, a he big get judgment, COVID. <laughs> uh, he, can, he can watch his son be put to death. Man. Oh, Folks man, sit down, man. tied up, man. and watch his nigga get killed. Not like a quick gunshot to the head. I'm right. talking about cut Punch. up, chopped up. I got one. Okay? Take the chip or we're going to cut your son up in the bits. Man. Right. Think about that shit, man. So the word money I even get is that. more like get that little nigga. Yep. All right. I got, I got one. I think got a definition. <laughs> hey, this, uh, this John 6 and 63. It is the spirit that quickens it. The flesh profited nothing. Uh. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. Mm. Plain. Plain. The words we are speaking to the elect, the hope of the elect, they are life. This is quickening it in the blue letter. It says to produce alive, beget or bear oh, living wow. young, to cause to live, make alive, give life, to restore to life, to give increase of life of the spirit quickening as respects the spirit and endued with new and greater powers of life. Oh, oh stop the top of here now. This is the uh, blue letter for uh, quickening, to produce alive, beget or bear living young, to cause to live, make alive, give. Cause to live. See, the spirit that we are giving you is causing you to live. When you go to Genesis, the second chapter, it says he breathed their breath, uh, breathed their nostrils, the breath of life, which was the nostrils with the understanding, the law, it caused them to what? To start living. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They was already living, but what they were living as what? Proof beef. Right. They were living as animals. Yeah. But when the, law, when the Lord put the law and statutes and commandments in them, they really started to live, man. Right. In order. Go ahead, y'all. It says, to give life, uh, to restore to life. To look, to restore. We restore life back again, man, because we all was once dead. Right. We were dead. What did it say? He, Call us out of darkness to his marvelous light. light. Darkness is the congregation of the dead. Marvelous light is the truth, man. Hey, yeah. Because what y'all was I say? I'm the truth. Wait, man, what? Six and forty three. Yeah. 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 So I did say the six chapter did. To us, <laughs> also, yeah. the hope of the elect, man. That's what we're doing out here. We be out here preaching this gospel, bringing forth this word, man. That's right. That's right. It says, by spiritual power to arouse... Oh, spiritual power. Is this not a form of spiritual power? Oh, God. No? What we doing right now, that's a, that's a form of spiritual power. Man. It is. Okay. It says, to arouse and invigorate. Yeah. And I got that word for invigorate. It says, to refresh, revive. Oh. Woo! Refresh. <laughs> wake up. 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 Hey, wake up! Uh, High time! Wake up. Yeah. Out of sleep! Out of sleep. Uh, uh, we, we, we walk asleep at all. Oh, it's spiritual, man. That's right. You know? It says of the spirit. Of the spirit, see? 
That's how I try to wake out of sleep to wet salvation. Salvation is nearer than we believe. That's right. Go ahead, Doc. Wickening as respects the spirit endued with new and greater powers of life. Look, new and greater powers of life. Mm. Which is what? It's true. Good. Because this is what's going to save us, man. At the end of the day, wisdom and knowledge shall be the bit of our times, man. This is what's going to save us, man. That's right. Not the AR-15, not the 4-5, right. not the 9, right. not the uh, 3 for the 7, not the fucking Zelda sword. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. That ain't gonna save us. Right. Fucking bulletproof vest, that ain't gonna save us. What's gonna save us is this wisdom and knowledge and understanding, man, that's come from the Lord and the Spirit and power in our lives. You know what's up, man? That's, that's right. right! That's what's gonna save us. Right. That's why I said the Spirit quickened to make us alive, man. Okay, that's it on that. Oh, one more. It says, to give increase of life. To give increase of life. Hey, brother, doing this, bro, you've been increased, man, in the spirit. Yeah. You've been increased every day. Every day you've been increased in the spirit, man. That's right. By believing and having hope. By, 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 by reading, by studying, by being a brother to the brother. You've been increased, man. Let's say iron south in the earth. You know, when we watch a video, you know what I'm saying? What we just thinking in the spirit, meditate, we being increased, man. Yes, Any way it goes, we in the truth, we being increased through the spirit of power, y'all about small stuff, man. And that's the spirit, bro. That's the spirit, man. That's the spirit old breakdown. That's right there. Go ahead, Doc. Psalms 20 and 7. Uh, read down to 8, too. Uh, the law of the Lord is perfect. Converting the soul, the testimony of the Lord is sure, making wi making wise the simple. Is, oh, my bad, Salaki. Hey, that was a good one too, though. <laughs> that was a good one too. That was good the spirit. Talking about the testimony, not the testimony. How it shot the way. Spirit, 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 spirit prophecy. prophecy. Uh, you know, the spirit of wisdom. Psalms twenty and seven. Uh, read that again. Psalms twenty and seven. Uh, read that again. 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 Uh, read that Send thee help from the uh, sanctuary and straighten thee out of Zion. Yeah. Remember all thy offering, offerings and uh, accept thy burnt sacrifice, Shalak. Grant thee according to thine own heart and fulfill all thy counsel. For we reject in thy salvation and in the name yeah, of rejoice. our power. Oh, like Slack it. Rejoice. It's like it. Oh, no. We will rejoice in thy salvation and in the name of our power we will set up our banners. The Lord fulfill all thy petitions. Uh -huh. Now know that I, that the Lord saveth his anointed. Right. Woo! The Lord saveth his anointed, the chosen. Uh, uh, he, will hear, well, like, he will hear him from his holy heaven and with the saving strength of his right hand. Right, so a nigga or uh, Esau, he don't come up with a gun or whatever. We gonna call upon you, how about some other shit? That's right, that's right. You see? They say uh, uh, a stab is gonna be lifted, man. When, he's, when Jake get in a fender bender, you know, brothers, when they get in the location, they automatically call on the Lord with that. Yep. You get in a car wreck and you're spinning, you call on your whole about Shemel Shot. That's right. Yeah. And look, then the Lord stops you in, in just a, in, a, at an angle or whatever, and you're out of sight, everything you find. Yeah. And I'm good. The car may be told and fucked up, but hey, right. Right. the Lord yeah. saved yeah. me, man. Fuck that car, hey. man. Yeah. Hey, he, 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 we're here in the day of trouble. Right. Right. That's right. That's right. I, I, I know many brothers got testimonies like that. I know you do. Yeah. I do. Yeah. Yeah. Probably yeah. every brother. Yeah. 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 Some, yeah. Yeah. some yeah. stuff happened yeah. where it's like, damn. Yeah. I remember uh, I was driving one time and I was looking off, but my hit, my foot just hit the hit the brakes. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Because it was a car in front of me that stopped. I didn't even see the shit, bro. Yeah. I was like, damn, what the? It was basically like a some. Told yeah. me to like just hey, hit the brakes. Oh, like, What's up? Hey, how about you, man? We almost got in a wreck coming to camp, man. This dumbass, well eyed nigga he was on three lanes, but he was trying to get like get over. But it was on third lane. He almost hit a pole. And this nigga almost like real deal, he's coming hit the yeah. side of the boss car in the passenger seat. I'm sick. Yeah, yeah. 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 You drive the worst of us. You know how the lanes go. Yeah. This uh, Proverbs 18 and 10. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run into it and it's safe. That's plain, man. That's plain this Go ahead. This is Wisdom Solomon 9 and verse 6. Uh, For though a man be never so perfect among the children of men, yet if thou wilt and be not with him, he shall be nothing regarded. 
Come, this is this is wisdom of Solomon 9 and 6. For though a man be never so perfect among the children of men, yet if thy wisdom be not with him, he shall be nothing regarded. Nothing regarded. <laughs> God, that's, that's it. Man, it's plain. Man, it's it's it. in Psalms 20 and 7. Some trust in chariots and some in horses. But we will remember the name of the Lord, our power, Yahweh by Shem Al Shai. Some trust in uh, chariots and horses, some trust in guns, some yeah. trust in uh, military, artillery and shit. But hey, we go remember the name of Yahweh by Shem Al Shai, man. Right. Hey, you like, say uh, the angels kept around about them. Psalms 30, uh, yeah. what's that? Psalms 30, uh, 37? Or 34? 34. 34. 34. 34. <laughs> They're not gonna be keep you stable, man. Yeah. But wisdom is, you know, knowledge is. Understanding of the scriptures. They're gonna keep you stable in the time that are coming, man. We just take the trouble, man. That's right. You know? Right. I got a quick right. one just to back you up, about. <laughs> uh this this is first Maccabees 12 and 9. Therefore we also, albeit we need none of these things. For that we have the holy books of the scripture in our hands to comfort us. To comfort us, man. This is our weapons right here, man. Uh, yep. You see? Everything's spiritual, man. But like we were saying, everybody got their lots, man. Uh, yeah. You know? Everybody got their lots. So, hey, we can't get mad. Hey, yeah. Lord had blinded them, man. Uh -huh. You know? <laughs> hey, go to the first Maccabees 6. Cause this is first Maccabees 6 and 43. 43. Like, make sure I'm right there. This is six and forty-three. Uh -huh. Elazar -El -El also, El -El yeah. So like Elazar, uh -huh. also surname. Uh, so, how you say it out? Uh, Saran, Saran, perceiving that one of the beasts. Armed with royal royal harness was higher than all the rest, and and supposing that the king was upon him, uh -huh. put himself in jeopardy to end to to the end he might deliver his people and give him a prepare a perpetual name. Wait, and this is going in how Jake didn't want to wait on the king. He was trying to make a name for himself, man. Same thing with the cats are doing now. You see, they ain't trying to wait for Yahweh but him on shot. You see? They say he put himself in on jeopardy. I Meaning danger, man. Yeah. Go ahead. Wherefore he ran upon him courageously through the midst of the battle, slaying on the right hand and on the left, so that they were divided from him on both sides. Uh -huh. Verse 46. Which done he crept under the elephant and thrust him under un Salakia. Which done he crept under the elephant and thrust him under under and slew him, whereupon the elephant fell down upon him, and there he died. And there he died. That was the end of it. That was the end solution of it. Try to make a name for yourself, you're going to die, man. Try to take arms and do on your own, you're going to die, man. Yeah. Try to make a name for yourself, man. And the Lord told us just wait upon him. Yeah. He's going to live for us up, man. It's had a mixture here in the earth, man. Yeah. You see? You don't have to go get guns and do all that and that. You see? That's a prime example right there for not waiting on the Lord, man. Yeah. An order, commandment, man. You know? They want to feel like they got some type of power, man. But, but our true power is in the name of your how about shot, man. That's our power, man. Take, you know what I'm saying? Esau going to his power. Esau using what, 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 uh, what yeah. the Lord blessed him with. He relying on the uh, sword, man. Yeah, he's that out, was a blessing. He's out tapping in his power. Yeah. We can tap it in on our power, That's man. That's it, man. Yeah, what the scripture says, the just shall live by faith. No. Just live by trust by in the Lord, man. But sure not, because you want to get that AR-15. <laughs> yeah, man. You want to have, hey, that's, that's, that, that mindset of 
want what the heathen got. Yes, uh, he got it. I want, I, I, I want that too. Man. I, well, I can't, yeah, well, I can't have that. Hold on, drum on that beat, bro. Right. Man, well, that's, that's, we can shit, shit like you saying, the brother was saying, that shit jam up or anything, man. man. Uh, I try, I got it. I got one from the coming board. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, go ahead. Uh, okay. GMS Memphis, Calabria Ba. Proverbs 1 and 7. The fear of your of your hour <clears throat> is the beginning of knowledge. But fools despise wisdom and instruction. That's the spirit, but we just brought that out, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, hey. That was uh, Calabria. It said, uh, uh, read it again. Right, so like it. That was uh, Proverbs 1. Proverbs seven. 1 and 7. 1 and 7. I right, get it, bro. Yeah, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge. But fools despise wisdom and instruction, man. So that guy was a fool, man. You know? He despised the instruction of what the men of the Lord were trying to tell him, man. You know what I'm saying? The right way to, uh, 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 to live your life, man. You follow behind the Lord, man. And not trust in, you know, uh, uh, your weapons, man. You know? Not, not trusting in men. You know? I get Isaiah 32 or 2. There's one thing about it. Jake got patience. You know what I'm saying? Jake, Jake patience. But then what the trick about, man, is about being patient. You know what I'm saying? Patience comes with suffering, man. Long suffering. You know, you're suffering in the flesh. You know what I'm saying? Because the spirit, you're just revealing our pain into the truth, man. Yep. Jake trying to be patient, man. But being impatient, but being impatient, you're fucked up, man. They even, they even, they even teach you in the world being impatient. Uh, get you uh, in trouble. Isaiah 32 and 3. 2. 2. So like it. This is Isaiah 32 and 2. And a man shall be as a hiding place from the wind. You see that? The elect man gonna be as a hiding place from the wind. Go ahead. And a cup and a cover from the tempest. For the tempest. We say Esau Eagles will come in like a flood. You see? Go ahead. As rivers of waters in a dry place. In a dry place, As as the shadows of a great rock in a in a weary land. Just America, man. The shadows of death. Valley shadows of death, man. Mm. But the point is, it say a man should be, uh, it's a hiding place for the wind, mm. for the tempest. You see? Hey, right, we gonna be protected, man. Right. You know, everything is that go, about to come here is for, uh, for the wicked, it's for the ungodly. They say uh, famine, hell, death, and destruction. Good. All these were made for the ungodly, man. This is, uh, this is not made for us, man. You see? Right. Dad, <laughs> <laughs> she asked that she was What did you say? This is uh, Ecclesiastes 7 and, uh, and 8. It says. Better is the end of a thing than the beginning thereof, and the patient in spirit is better than the proud in spirit. That's right. Yep. Patient in spirit. Because that was the truth is that we are patient. We think I went in the Lord. You know what? We want this king to come tomorrow or yesterday. You know what I'm saying? We think I went in the Lord, man. You know, because it's being patient. Come. Is it in book of Sirach 33 and 1? There shall no evil happen unto him that feareth the Lord, but in but in temptation, even again, he will deliver him. Yeah. 
I know, right? <laughs> Weird shit. Man. Yeah, right in there, oh yeah. Shalom. Shalom.